What's going on, everybody? Welcome back to the Dubai Championships, and it's the women's final. Two players that I think at the start of the week, I don't know, maybe you wouldn't have predicted, considering they're both unseated, and the stacked event it was. I mean, you had, you know, Krejcikova, Sabalenka, Badosa, Muguruza, Sviontek, Halep, you know, a bunch of players playing in this one, and this is the final. Very interesting final. But both players have played very well. And both players have beaten some really big names. We all know about Ostapenko's run to the final, but Kudamatova's played some really big names as well and beaten some champions as well. So these two ladies well and truly deserve to be in the final stage. Um, never played before, so this is the first time they've ever played in singles. They've played a lot in doubles. In fact, they're actually playing the doubles as well uh, after this match, I think. Is it straight after the match they play the doubles? So <laughs> they're going to play each other twice today. Uh, at the very, uh, yeah, in the doubles as well. So uh, that's very interesting to see that. Now, Rublev is on court. We're keeping on Rublev. I think uh, the Doha final is about to start as well. So we're keeping on that scoreline. Uh, FAA is coming on very soon. We'll keep an eye on that. Um, but I, I don't know. I expect this one to go to go a while. I, I would be very shocked if this was straight sets and I'd be very shocked if it was an easy win for either player. I think both have their, have their chances to win in different ways. It's going to be interesting. It'll be interesting to see how this plays out. Now, let me know in the chat if you have any bets on, because it's one of those matches where Ostapenko is the favorite, but I, I think Kudamaktova is underrated. I think she's very underrated. And she doesn't... Uh, you know, she, she's been playing well this week, and hasn't played as much as what Ostapenko has. So it's going to be interesting to see how the if you guys have put any money on this match. How the betting is as well, because uh, Ostapenko is the favorite, but I'd be looking at uh, looking at three sets at least for this one. If not, going with the over 21 and a half games. All right, so let's go to the preview, because uh, these players are about to come out on court in about probably about five, ten minutes. And uh, like I said, these two have never played before, but they have both had very impressive runs to get to the final. All right, starting with... The draw, you've got uh, Ostapenko demolished Halep in the final set there. It was a very impressive performance. Uh, she caught fire very late on and just in time as well because she was about to go out in straight sets and she caught fire and ended up winning the match 6 love in the final set and could have been over. Didn't even hit a ball in her semi-final. She got a walkover because Von Drusova, the qualifier, pulled out with an injury. So could have been is going to be feeling fresh. Ostapenko... I mean, she was complaining yesterday about some uh, some fitness problems, so we'll, we'll see. Let's talk about Veronica Kudamatova. She's 31 in the world. She's 24 years old from Russia. She's 5'8", right-handed, five wins, three losses on the year, including a final in Melbourne earlier this year. And no titles to her name. Uh, no, sorry, no titles this year. Uh, she won a title last year, so that's... Uh, I think she's got one singles title to her name. And her best wins of the year are against Brengel and Ruse. Ostapenko, 21 in the world. She is uh, 24 years old from Latvia. 5'10", right-handed. Five wins, three losses as well. No titles this year and uh, four to her name, including a French Open. And her best wins are against Risk and Sasnovic. But those will change because this week they've both beaten multiple champions. Now, let's have a chat about the, uh, the run uh, for both these ladies because we all know about Ostapenko. She's had a great run. To get to the final, she's beaten champion after champion after champion after champion. She's beaten Kennan, Sviontek, Kvitova, Halep. But Kudamatova, she had Azarenka in the first round. Beat her in straight sets. Beat Muguruza in four se uh, sorry, three sets. Demolishing everybody this week. Um, beating all the champions this week. And Kudamatova in the final. Uh, I'll see you guys tomorrow for the final in Marseille. Ostapenko gets the win. Just like the street lights lit this time Like a fire in a blaze, got